Today I'm showing you how to make these super delicious cornflake cookies. To start, you want to preheat your oven to 150 degrees fan. For other temperatures, they'll be listed here. Add your cornflakes to a big bowl and give them a beat with your wooden spoon. Next, add in your malt powder. This gives the cookie a really nice flavour. Followed by the caster sugar and half a teaspoon of salt. Next, you want to pour over your melted butter. And then just stir that all together and make sure the butter is evenly distributed. Once that's all mixed, we're going to pour it out onto a baking tray lined with some baking paper. Just make sure it's evenly spread out and it's a nice thin layer. That then goes into the oven for about 10 to 15 minutes until it crisps up and it's nice and crunchy. While we're waiting for the cornflake mixture to cook, we can get going on the cookie dough. So add your butter into a big bowl and then add into that some soft light brown sugar. I'm now going to beat that together until it's lovely and fluffy. Don't forget to scrape down the sides of the bowl as you want to get everything from around the edges. And then just pop it back on and give it another beat. Then want to lower the speed and add in one egg. Make sure you beat well after each addition as you want it to be fully incorporated. Add in your second egg and beat that in as well. Add in half a teaspoon of vanilla extract. Into the bowl, you then want to beat in your dry ingredients. So I've got some flour, some baking powder, some baking soda, also known as bicarbonate of soda in America, and then half a teaspoon of salt. Beat the dough until it comes together. Crumble up the cornflakes and add it into your cookie dough. Finally, add in your chocolate before giving it a last beat to bring it all together. Once that's all combined, you want to create some dough balls. You're looking for roughly the same size as two heat tablespoons. Place them onto a baking tray spaced out as they will spread while baking. Pop them into the oven to bake for 12 to 15 minutes. Once baked, leave them on their tray for five minutes before transferring to a wire rack to cool completely. This is optional, but I've decided to dip half of my cookie in milk chocolate and then sprinkle over some cornflakes. So that's cornflake cookies, easy. Hope you got that. Oh, it would help if I had a... Oh. I'm not gonna bowl in properly. Oh. <laughs> yeah, it's not gonna work. And give it another whisk. Break down your bowl as you want to get everything from around the bowl. No. <laughs> okay.